What's up guys, since Cobra here and I've been tagged by Spike Saturn. Um, yeah, I'm going to be trying something new and putting some gameplay in the background. Uh, so I'm pretty much going to answer four questions and I'm not sure if I'm going to tag anyone since I don't know who to tag. But um, yeah, the first question is, what is your favorite console? And I think as of right now, my favorite console is the Xbox 360. Um, I pretty much you know game on that thing like all the time uh... i really also enjoy the super nintendo so you know some of my favorite games are on there um, like super mario world uh... mega man x mortal kombat 3 the donkey kong country series you know, so, um... some really really good games are on that system uh, and it was also my first system ever so I really, really like that system also. Um, next question is, what console do you own the most games for? And just by looking over at my shelf, I would probably say I have the most Xbox 360 games. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, probably most Xbox 360 games by by a long shot. Um, now mainly, mainly because, uh, you know, I'm older now and I ha I can spend my money on whatever I want and you know I get I get more easier opportunities ways to get money so I tend to spend my money on games a lot so and you know when you're you're younger your parents don't really want to buy you games so that's probably the main reason why I have the most 360 games um Next question is, what game purchase do you regret the most? And the most recent game purchase I regret is Scribblenauts on the DS. I really cannot get into that game. Um, I heard great things about it. You know, I went in knowing that uh, the controls weren't that that great, but uh, you know, the concept the the concept for the game. Sounded cool. It sounded like it could be fun, you know, good, good time waster on the DS. You know, and also, I also needed something for uh, my trip down to Disneyland like a couple weeks ago. But uh, yeah, I just cannot get get into that game. The is the controls are the my main complaint about it. You know, the puzzles aren't aren't really that bad. There's some tricky puzzles, and you know, you don't really really know. What you what will work for the for the puzzles you so you got to keep trying and stuff but um yeah mainly it's the controls I just they're they're way too frustrating for me uh, hopefully they fixed it in the second one um, maybe I'll pick it up one day if after doing research but yeah I just cannot get into scribble knots I also kind of regret buying uh, uh the Force Unleashed two I bought that you know on release date I got the limited edition and you know the game was sort was sort of disappointing. I didn't. I kind of wish I waited because I'm looking at Amazon like I saw on Amazon like a week ago. They have they actually have the limited edition on clearance for like 30 bucks. So that's that's way better price than 80 bucks. You know, but the fanboy, the Star Wars fanboy in me, couldn't resist buying it day one. Um, but yeah, those those are the two games I I really remember regretting regretting uh, buying so the next question is do you think video game ratings are important and yeah I think they're important I mean down over here in California uh, our government is actually battling uh, I think they it's called the EMA or something uh, they're and they're actually having um, Supreme Court cases or something about a uh, about banning violent video games and stuff and you know things like these could be uh, avoided if the government just supported the ESRB ratings. I mean, th I know some stores they kind of don't don't really they kind of ignore them. You know, sell so they sell rated M games to to kids under 17, but you know, in the in the perfect world. We wouldn't have little kids 
screaming at you in Modern Warfare 2 or something. But yeah, I think I think video game ratings are important and and they really do help sometimes. Um. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I don't know if I'm gonna tag anyone. I'll, I'll probably. I guess I guess I can tag uh, my friend Xbox Master since he has trouble talking about stuff in his commentaries and this will give him something to talk about but um yeah check out spike saturn's channel uh he tagged me and hopefully you guys enjoyed the gameplay in the background i believe i went 31 and like four or something so yeah hope you guys learned a little bit about me and i'll be seeing you guys next time adios